Welcome to the Minecraft Education Edition Camera, Portfolio and Book and Quill Tutorial. You don't have to be an expert in Minecraft to be able to lead a Minecraft lesson in the classroom. And learning how to take pictures and edit and export books in Minecraft will give you the confidence to play, create and learn. So get your mouse and keyboard ready and let's begin. This tutorial will introduce you to the camera, the portfolio and the book and quill. Instructions will appear at the bottom of the screen above your hotbar, providing assistance on what to do next. Right click the camera besides this board to take a selfie. The camera will auto focus on you, so feel free to move about and wait five seconds before capturing the picture. You'll know it's ready to take a picture when it starts rapidly flashing. So let's right click the camera. As you can see, it's starting to follow me around the room until click, it takes a picture. We see a short preview of the picture and the next area opens up for us. When you have a camera selected in your inventory, you can take pictures by pointing your cursor at what you'd like to capture and right clicking with the camera. Be careful when aiming at a subject. If you're looking down at the top of a block, you may place the camera instead of taking a picture. If that happens, left click the camera to get rid of it. Take a few pictures with the camera you've been given and then speak with the NPC when you're done. The NPC says, once you're done taking pictures, press the I'm done button below. Make sure to take plenty of pictures though, you'll need them later. You can take more pictures by pressing not yet. Well, I've taken many pictures, so let's press I'm done. The next area has opened up and I have been given a portfolio. Let's read the sign. Your portfolio is where all the pictures you take are stored. You can caption them, delete them or even export your entire portfolio to PDF. Open the portfolio we've given you by selecting it on your hotbar and right clicking with it. Rewatch the companion video if you get stuck editing your portfolio. Once you're done speak with the NPC. So, Let's right click our portfolio and take a look at the pictures. I have some duplicates in here, so I'm going to delete them with the trash icon. Let's caption some of these images too. There. Now let's export the portfolio to my desktop with the export button at the bottom. It's that easy. OK, to come out of the portfolio, press the X in the upper right corner or the escape key. Right click the NPC when you're finished and press I'm done button to open up the next area. A book and quill allows you to combine the pictures you have taken with additional text to create your own book. You edit text by clicking on a page. You can add pictures delete pages and other options by clicking the pencil at the bottom of each page. Open the pre-made book and quill we've given you by selecting it on your hotbar and right click it to write in it. Once you're done reading it, talk with the NPC for more info. When I right click the book it opens and says you can combine both text and pictures. Your book and quill can be a maximum of 50 pages. To navigate between pages click the arrow on the right side of page 2. Click to page 3 to learn more. OK, let's click on the arrow to go to page 3. On page 3 it says this is another page. Uh, when done editing you can sign it which will disable editing. It will also allow you to export it to PDF. Try it by signing this book. Let's press the sign button at the bottom and give a title to my book. My first book and then press sign and close. Remember after you do this you cannot edit the book anymore and the book's icon changes too. If I right click this book now the only options are to export it. OK, right click the NPC to find out what happens next. Now that you've seen an edited book and quill let's create our own. Press the book and quill button below to get a blank one. If you're done, press the I'm done button to complete the tutorial and enter the bonus area. Or press not yet 
to continue this activity. Well, we want a book and quill, so press that button. Now we have a fresh book and quill in our hands. Right click to open it. On the first page, I'm going to write, this is my second book. And on the second page, I want to add a picture. Click the pencil icon to open up the page editing icons. There are four, add new page, add image, trash, move page. I'm going to add an image. Great. Now let's move it and add another page. Keep playing with these options until you feel confident about them. Once you've finished, close the book with the escape key or the little cross in the corner and right click the MPC. Press I'm done. And that's it, we've completed the lesson. For a bonus, you can wander the town and try your hand at taking pictures and writing in a book. Go and have some fun.